Welcome to the documentary about the Nazca Lines a series of ancient geoglyphs located in the Nazca Desert in southern Peru. These lines, which were created by the Nazca culture between 500 BCE and 500s, are huge designs and patterns etched into the desert floor. They are so large that they can only be fully appreciated from the air, making them a mystery to those who haven't seen them firsthand. The Nazca lines have over 800 straight lines, 300 geometric figures, and 70 animal and plant designs. The lines range in length from a few meters to over 30 kilometers, and some of them are so straight that they seem to stretch to the horizon. The figures include a spider, a monkey, a hummingbird, and a condor, among others. The purpose of the Nazca lines is unknown but there are several theories about their function. Some believe that they were created as a form of communication with the gods, while others think they were used for astronomical or ritual purposes. Some even speculate that they served as a kind of ancient landing strip for extraterrestrial visitors. One of the most exciting things about the Nazca lines is the level of engineering and planning that went into their creation. The lines were created by removing the top layer of dark stones from the desert floor, revealing the lighter colored soil underneath. This process known as desert pavement, allowed the lines to be visible for centuries. The Nazca lines have been a source of fascination for centuries, and they continue to draw thousands of visitors each year. Despite their popularity, the lines are at risk of being damaged by tourism and natural weathering. To protect these ancient wonders, the Peruvian government has implemented several measures, including a ban on walking on the lines and the establishment of viewing platforms for tourists. One of the most enduring mysteries of the Nazca lines is how they were created. The lines are so precise and the patterns so intricate that it's hard to imagine how the ancient Nazca people could have created them without some kind of advanced technology or aerial perspective. One theory is that the Nazca people used simple tools and techniques such as ropes and sticks, to create the lines. Another theory is that they used mirrors or other reflective devices to create the straight lines and precise patterns. Despite the many theories about the Nazca lines, the truth is that we may never know exactly how they were created. The Nazca people left behind no written records and the lines themselves offer few clues as to their purpose or construction. Despite this lack of concrete information, the Nazca lines continue to inspire fascination and speculation. They have been studied by scientists, archaeologists, and amateur enthusiasts for decades, and they remain one of the most mysterious and intriguing ancient sites in the world. In addition to their historical and cultural significance, the Nazca Lines are also an important natural site. The desert surrounding the lines is home to a variety of unique flora and fauna, including several species that are found nowhere else in the world. The Nazca Lines and the surrounding desert are protected as a UNESCO World Heritage Site, and the Peruvian government works to preserve and protect this important cultural and natural site. To end this documentary on the Nazca Lines, I would like to emphasize the importance of preserving and protecting these ancient wonders. The Nazca Lines are more than just a tourist attraction, they are a testament to the ingenuity and creativity of the ancient Nazca culture, and they hold a wealth of information about our history and the way that human societies have evolved over time. As we continue to study and learn about the Nazca Lines, it is important that we do so with respect and care. The lines are vulnerable to damage from both natural weathering and tourism, and it is up to all of us to do our part in preserving them for future generations. So, if you've enjoyed this documentary on the Nazca Lines, please consider sharing it with your friends and family. And don't forget to hit the like and subscribe buttons to stay up to date on all of our latest content. Together, we can help spread awareness about the importance of preserving our cultural and natural heritage. Thank you for watching.